Shout out to this user for the request. Enjoy. Okay, class. I've graded your open book tests. Everyone did great on it. Everyone except one. Hey! Why do you always have to throw me under the bus like that? Because, as much as you misbehave, you make it easy. But anyway, I put your tests under your desks. You may look at your grade. What the heck, Mrs. Christina? Why do you always fail me? You think I enjoy this? No, you do not study. You got every answer wrong. Maybe if you spend less time playing Fortnite, and more time studying, you'd get a better grade. But anyways, we'll be learning about fractions today, so take out your workbooks. Duck, I can't stand Mrs. Christina. She's always trying to find a reason to pick on me. I need to get revenge on her. But how? I got it. I'll get her arrested. This will teach her. Now I'm going to spread false information about her on the school newsletter. I'll say that she's a thief. Now to upload it, and wait. And that's how you solve for X. Now can anyone demonstrate how? Um, who is that banging on my door? Mrs. Christina, you're under arrest for suspicion of theft. What? But I've never stolen anything in my life. You must have the wrong person. Don't argue with me. Come with me to the police car now. Mrs. Christina, a thief? I can't imagine. I know, right? Something doesn't add up. Ha 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 All according to plan. Um, Dora, why are you scheming? That's no reason. I just like to make faces. Okay then. Alright, now where's all the stuff you stole? I already have men searching your house. Officer, I'm trying to tell you, I didn't steal anything. Where did all of this come from? The principal called me and said that it was in the newsletter of your school. May I see this newsletter? Wait a minute. It was one of my unruly students' Dora Marcus. How do you know? She signed her name at the bottom. Oh my goodness. You're absolutely right. I'm so sorry for the misunderstanding. I will make sure she is punished big time. Mrs. Christina, what are you doing here? I thought you were arrested. Mr. Cherry, we have evidence to prove I'm innocent. It was actually Dora who wrote that false paper. Take a look. Oh my goodness. I should have known the troublemaker is behind this. I apologize for the mistake, Mrs. Christina. You are no longer fired. However, I will deal with Dora. Dora Marquez, report to my office now. Dora, I know it was you who wrote that lie about Mrs. Christina to try to get her in trouble. Maybe you shouldn't have wrote your signature at the bottom. Doc, I'm so stupid. Why did I do that? 
The real question is, why did you write that lie about her? Because I got tired of her failing me and picking on me in class. I'm so sorry for what I've done. You think sorry will save you from getting in trouble? I almost went to jail because of you, and if you just study in class like you're supposed to, then I wouldn't fail you. You're expelled for the remainder of the school year. And you're under arrest for false allegations. Get in the police car now. This is your cell. You'll be staying here for a long time. And you have visitors. Dora, how dare you get Mrs. Christina in trouble by writing in the school newsletter? You are most counter lo quiero por causa yo por being selfish. Yo de serios lo topini. That's it, you're grounded forever and ever. Now go to sleep in your prison bed. What a